Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and excuse the mess on the table. I have to, like these don't belong here. That thing back there doesn't belong here. This is my kid's um, attempt at a gingerbread house. Yeah, um, a lot of the stuff needs to be moved around. That stuff I have to wrap. I just, it's messy. Um, but I was so excited for this haul. It's up the creek since, as the title gives away. And I feel like I've been waiting forever, but I haven't. Now when I ordered, the TAT was 10 days. But she also did state that she was taking two weeks off, I think, or something. So I knew it was going to be longer than 10 days. Um, so she sends an invoice, and I didn't spend very much. My total was $42.10, including shipping. Shipping was $7.60. She refunded the, like, almost $3 for um, the shipping cost, I'm assuming. And I can tell you guys I am so impressed with this order. So I'll start with a little note. It says, Angela, thank you so much. So very much, actually. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your smellies. I hope you like them. Merry Christmas. Love, Shanna. First of all, yes, I love everything. And she was super generous with samples as well. And I know we all say that we don't like samples or they they don't need. I prefer samples because how else are you going to know if you really like something? There's something in here that I thought I would never have thought of, actually. Just never. And it's probably, like, my new favorite scent. So, I'll get started, and I'll save that one for last. Vanilla butter fudge, which we all know what that smells like. It's just a nice, creamy, buttery, fudgy smell. And look at my hand. I don't know what happened here. Yeah, that's amazing. It's like a, a batter smell almost to me. I can't explain it, but I love it. And I also like her labeling. I think it's cute. It's simple. It's not too over the top. I love it. Gingerbread cupcake. This one, I mostly smell cupcake right now. I do get a hint of gingerbread, but I'm used to like a spicy gingerbread, and I don't get that with this one, but it is nice and creamy and good. There's that one. Cranberry peach cider. This is amazing. It doesn't really smell like cider. Maybe a little bit, but mostly I get like a really sweet cranberry scent and you get the peach after and it's divine. I love this scent. And this is like a good scent for any time of the year. If you're a seasonal melter, I am not. Okay. Pink Christmas tree. Never in my life would I've ordered this. I'm so over pine scents, but this I could do a full pig of brittle in and I don't know if that would even be enough. It's amazing. Oh my gosh. Okay. I mean, it's pink sugar and pine, I'm assuming, but it's like got the softness to it. It is lovely. Like, I am in love with this scent. I will be sure to order one on this so I have some for next year for sure. Love that. Then I'll start with the scent shots, and I actually thought I ordered all four packs, but I didn't. And that's because I get into hyper mode when I order from companies, and I don't know why. Um... But they were scent shots because I looked at my invoice and that makes me sad. Because this, I always try blueberry marshmallow blends when I see them. And this is by far my favorite. The only people that I see offer blueberry marshmallow blends are RTS companies. I don't see, I mean I could make the blend. But I don't see them offering them in bags or anything. Like um, Sniff My Tarts or Rose Girls. I don't see any of blueberry marshmallow blends. And this is by far my favorite one that I've smelled. It is absolutely amazing. So I already see myself placing an order with her after the holidays, which I know I shouldn't do. I don't have the room, and I will do a, a collection video tonight. I have to organize it first, though, because it is a really a hodgepodge of mess, and I just don't know if I can show it like that. Gee, your hair smells terrific, and I think this is Biolage. I don't know. I don't read some descriptions. But I think that's what I smell. It's still kind of frozen. So you know how when it's just out of the freezer, it doesn't smell quite as strong. That's how these are because they're frozen. But it smells really good. And I like that one a lot. Um, I had something to say and I totally spaced out. Um, oh, I went really safe with my scents because it's a new-to-me vendor. And now I'm wishing I would have branched out and gotten more. And I kept it small because it's a new-to-me vendor. Um, actually, when I first heard of this company... I was watching an old video from Sarah Face, 80 something. Um, and I think she would, it was only available on eBay, I think, or something. I don't know. 
But then I was watching another video on YouTube, Ashley Smith, I think it was, and there was a website, so I ordered. So let's just get started. Strawberry ice cream. I wanted to smell her strawberry scent, and I thought this would be a good way to try it. And I think this is probably the only one I saw on there. I don't remember. Mm, and it's good. It's like a creamy strawberry. Like strawberries and cream is what it smells like to me. And I love it. I love these four packs. And I think the pricing is absolutely affordable. Three fifty dollars for this. And from what I've told, you can get four uses out of them. So... And I also like it because if you do have to use two tarts, you at least get two times. Not that I don't love Tiffany's, but sometimes you have to use two tarts and then you're stuck with the one and it doesn't really throw that great. So I do like the four tarts. And can I just say how awesome these discs are? I think this is probably my favorite. Like I'll show you on the sample. Covers my entire palm. I love these. This is in Marshmallow Bean Noel. And you get the marshmallow and the vanilla bean noel. And I'm excited for these to cure because I cannot wait to start melting them. And I'm melting this on Christmas. I know I say that every time, but this is what I'm melting. And if it is not cured, I don't care. I'm melting this. It's amazing. Lavender. I'll just do it like this. Lavender. And this is a very true life lavender scent, which I love. Um... Don't get me wrong, I love sweet lavender. And I love herbal lavender. And this is a floral lavender, like a genuine lavender scent. So I really, really love that. Sorry, I'm sniffling. I don't want to, like, suck in my snot with you guys, like, listening to me. Juniper Breeze. I'm not a floral person. I'm really not. But this scent is so good. Like, every time I see it, I have to order it. It is floral, but... There's like a clean, fresh scent to it as well. And for anyone who's ever had Juniper Breeze, you know what I'm talking about. Even the flower itself has like this clean, fresh scent to it. And in my opinion, it's amazing. So I love that. I actually love everything. Everything is fantastic. Eucalyptus and, Spe Eucalyptus and Spearmint. I have to go pick up my scent from school, so I'm rushing. Sorry, guys. Mm, that is amazing. Just a great eucalyptus experiment. Honestly, I think all the vendors use the same one, but I love it. Marshmallow coffee ice cream. I love coffee ice cream, and the marshmallow just makes it so much better. Like, it's not toned down. You still get that nice um, coffee ice cream scent, and then you just get the marshmallow with it. Really, really love that. I do want to try her marshmallow alone, though. This is serendipity, and this is more of um, like a coconut serendipity, but I still like it. Excited for that. Cotton candy. I mean, some of these I don't have to explain. Cotton candy is just cotton candy. Love it. And then my last one is pink peppermint, and I don't think I smelled this one yet. Okay, I can tell a difference in her pink sugar. I usually can't, but I really can in hers. Mm, I like it. And that could be why I like the pink Christmas tree so much. I don't know. Hers smells different to me, and I really like it a lot. So I'm going to place another order with her for sure. Um, I have to figure out how to make my stash look smaller. I did de-stash a lot of stuff um, last month in preparation for a lot of orders. And now that they came, it's just like I didn't... There's a little bit of room, but that's going to be gone once my Rose Girls order is here. And I have another Rainbow Melt haul coming. I don't know where the hell I'm going to put everything. Because when I said I would give up a bin, I didn't just, like, put it to the side. We took it to my son's room, put it in his closet for all of his, like, um, Ninja Turtle figures and stuff. So I literally gave up my bin. And I told my husband I wouldn't purchase another one. And he agreed not to get one. So I'm going to get kind of um, creative and try to figure something out. So I will try to do that video tonight. And after February, I'm going to be on a no-buy from anybody. I still want to get a couple orders in, but <clears throat> to get me through summer, 
but I, I will be on a no buy until probably July or August um, because I really want to melt through what I have. I don't want it to go to waste, so I'm going to try to go on a no buy. I'm not going to say that I will because, hello, that's almost impossible, but I'm going to try, and if I do order, they're going to be small. Anyway, enough rambling. I've got to get going, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. I definitely recommend this vendor. Amazing. And the shipping was fast. I live, this is actually the state over from me, and we go there to vacation. They have Mackinac Island, which is amazing and beautiful, and we go there a lot. So anyway, I think you guys should try her. Have a great day. I will be back later. Bye, guys.